Dear friends, the readings during the last week of the ordinary time of the year talks a lot about persecution. The readings focuses about the situation of the church soon after the death of Christ. The early Christians were subjected to persecution. They were subjected to trials and tribulations. And the readings urges the Christian community to remain faithful, to remain steadfast in their faith in the face of trials and tribulations, in the face of persecution. During this week, the first reading is taken from the book of Daniel. The book of Daniel also focuses on persecution. It was a time of trial and tribulation for faithful Jews. The Jews were subjected to persecution under the evil king Antiochus Epiphanes the Fault. He subjected the Jews to break the commandment of God, to practice idolatry, and to eat the forbidden meat, the pork. Some Jews, for fear of persecution, were also forced to give up their faith for fear. It was during this time of persecution that people like Daniel and the three young men, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, rise to be an example of fidelity. They are an example of how to remain steadfast in their faith in the face of persecution. They encourage their fellow Jews not to give up their faith. Some of them were involved in eating pork. Some failed to observe the Sabbath day, which was the day of the Lord. Some were involved in idolatry. Some even gave up their faith. And Prophet Daniel urges his fellow Jews not to give up their faith, not to indulge in evil practices, but to remain faithful even in the face of persecution. Daniel and the three young men, Shadrach, Meshach and Abednego, they were fearless, they were obedient to God and they remained steadfast even though they were subjected to so many trials and tribulations. During this week we also hear how Daniel was put in the lion's den because he failed to obey the command of the king. He prayed even when he was forbidden to pray three times because he loved the Lord every day. And because of his fidelity, look what God does. He shuts the mouth of the lion from eating Daniel. Great is our God. And when you are faithful, you see great things happen in your life. Though you go through trials and tribulations, but if you remain steadfast in your faith, God begins to do great things. You are not alone. God is with you. And that's exactly what the evangelist Luke is trying to tell his community who are undergoing persecution. And Jesus says, remain faithful. For I am with you. Heaven and earth will pass away, but my words will not pass away, says the Lord. And his words endure forever. His words are eternal. His words are life. And they bring life in abundance. Let us pray for that grace. Like the early Christian community, like Daniel, Shadrach, Meshach and Abednego, that in the face of trials and tribulations, in the face of impending persecution, that we may never give up on our faith, but remain steadfast in our faith and see the power and the glory of God that will be manifested in our lives.
We make this prayer to Christ our Lord. Amen.